Hello everyone and welcome to the first episode of my new ARK Survival Evolved Let's Play and I'm going to be playing this game with Dink Meeker and um, if you've watched my Fallout 76 Let's Play you probably know him better as John Nash. So hi Dink! <laughs> hey Dova, how's it going? Good. So anyways, um, just so y'all know um, I have actually played ARK. I used to play ARK quite a bit uh, a couple years ago. It's been about two years since I played it, though. So I'm probably going to be a little bit rusty. And they've also added uh, some new stuff since then that I haven't seen yet. So, um, But Dink has not played it at all. So right? he, he's going to be a noob, and that'll be fun. <laughs> it's actually worse than that. I've never even played any survival game unless uh, Minecraft counts. Mm, so... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> There's that. <laughs> so we are in the character creation menu here, and um, you really can't customize your character very much in this game. Um, you can change your skin color, and you can change your hair color. Not really, though. And I apologize yeah, for my rusty use of the menu. Um, I haven't played this game in a while, so... I'm not used to the menu anymore. And also, it was made for mouse and keyboard. This menu was designed for mouse and keyboard, and we are playing on Xbox, so I'm using a controller. So it is a little cumbersome to use with a controller, so I hope you can bear with me until I get it, because um, I keep wanting to use the wrong uh, stuff here. Anyway, <laughs> so I can change my eye color, not that it really uh, makes any difference. I can change my body proportions, uh, but that's about it. Um, so I'm probably not going to change anything. I mean, I think my character looks pretty good. What about you, Dink? Well, I made mine slightly smaller than a refrigerator. I figured, <laughs> you know, since the one clue you gave me was uh, that I should run a lot, I decided I'd better kind of look like a runner instead of a linebacker. <laughs> okay. Yeah, the male character looks like a bodybuilder. Sure anyway, <laughs> <laughs> all right, so I'm going to call my character Dova, because why not? That's me, so. Yeah, and uh, I guess I'll go with Dink. Okay. All right. Now, for the viewers, um, we are not going to be role-playing in this uh, series. We are just going to do a casual Let's Play. We're going to be ourselves just playing this game for fun because we we we, we were doing the role playing in Fallout 76 and we just kind of wanted now that now that that show is on a break right now we just kind of want to be on a break too in the role playing department we just wanted to kick back and relax with this game and just have some fun so no role playing um what else i think that's all <laughs> um i think you're going to be making fun of me a lot but other than that I yeah, think we're ready to go. Maybe so. <laughs> <laughs> um, yes. Yes, I think that's all the things I wanted to cover before we started. And um, so here we've got um, zones. So you can spawn your character in on different zones. This little, um, the square above where it says spawn region is yep. the map. It's, okay. it's grayed out right now because we haven't discovered it but that little tiny area where it's glowing down there that's that's the area okay. where it's pointing it out right now um that's the right. that's the south zone easy then there's other zones all over the map there's medium uh difficulty levels and easy and um hard um the hard ones tend to be up north where um there's actually like a polar region up there and so you could actually freeze to death okay uh, medium ones will be on the east or west coasts of the island which they have a more dangerous dinosaurs over there okay and south um the south zones are easier i think um the order that they're in one two three is actually the order i've spawned in all three of them over the last time last time i played i played um, 
I spawned in all three of these, and I think they're actually listed in order of difficulty. Um, okay. I think like South Zone Three is a little bit more difficult than South Zone Two, and South Zone One is the easiest. So I think we probably should spawn in two. One um, Zone One is actually my favorite place to spawn, not not because of difficulty, but just because I like the area. Okay. It's more interesting. <laughs> anyway, so let's. And so see there's it. no. Huh? There's no disadvantage to uh, starting in an easy area. You don't like lose out on loot or anything. No, I don't think. Okay. Well, no, like the medium zones are still on the beach. They're just okay. Um, and we can still get to them just later when we're higher level. Right. Yeah, you can actually run okay. to them pretty pretty quickly. They're just you might die okay. a lot on the way there. <laughs> right. So let's start on South Zone One. Okay. Easy. Ready? Alrighty. You ready? <laughs> I am almost ready. I will be right there. All right. I'm going to spawn in. All right. Here I I'm go. Right behind you. Oh, good. It's daytime. Awesome. Now, it is quite possible to be killed immediately after you arrive on Ark. <laughs> That'll be fun. Um, but it looks like I'm not going to this time because I don't see anything nearby. All right, for okay. those of you who have not played Ark before, or even watched videos of Ark before, I will just give you a yeah, I'll just give you a quick rundown about what kind of a game this is. This is a survival game, and it is a hardcore survival game. It's brutal. Um. You have to eat, drink, to survive. You have to harvest, 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 harvest. Tons of stuff. We're going to be harvesting constantly. And we can build. We can build anything all over the map. And I see... What is that? Oh, that's a dodo. Oh, good. I was like, that looks like a Dilophosaurus. Okay. But it's not. It's a dodo. Okay. Anyways. Um, are you here yet, Dink? You're not here yet. I am loading in. Go okay. ahead. So we gotta harvest trees and rocks and all kinds of stuff to make craft things, and we have to hunt. Oh, there you are. Okay, I see you. You're just getting up yep. off the ground. All right. Hey, you're Hello. Sweetie. Hi. All right. And we have to also craft our own clothing, so we gotta do that soon too. Also, um, you can see that big like building off of the distance there over the trees yep that's called an obelisk it's not actually a building it's floating in the sky oh, um all right it's sort of like a gateway to the mothership or whatever you want to call it i don't know what it's called anyway it's right. so Ark Do does to get there have a bit of a story eventually yeah it's end game you know it sort of has okay. a story. It doesn't have any quests. So we're not going to have a quest journal. Our our purpose is to just survive. We need to collect rocks. Collect rocks. And we need to um, hit the logs with our fists. And grab batch and wood. Once you have... One okay, wood. So this could, like, hurt a lot in the real world. Yeah. Well, it is actually damaging your health. Once you, once oh, you have, mm -hmm, once you have one wood and one thatch, you can go into your crafting menu and craft a pickaxe. All right. And then, if you double click on it, it'll put it down in your quick menu, and then you can harvest stuff easier without having to. Okay. Where is your crafting? Um, there's a tab. Crafting, it'll, it'll, at the top it says inventory, and then there's a crafting tab. Okay. You just go over. Also, you're going to be leveling um, pretty oh, quickly. Oh, I see it. You will level really fast at the beginning. So, um. Yeah, I already leveled once. Yeah, so put points into weight first. Until you get about 200 weight, don't put points into anything else until you get about 200 weight. I thought you said we wanted to be able to run. Yeah. But first we need weight. We're going to kill this dodo bird. 
All right. Because we're going to need meat and hides. Now, an axe will actually get you more meat, uh, more hides. And, or wait, wait, does it? Is it backwards? <laughs> I might be saying that. Backwards. I think an axe gets you more hides and a pickaxe gets you more meat. Uh, I can't remember. As I said, it's been two years since I... Why can't I hit this guy? There it goes. I love it in there already. Yeah. Okay. I am missing thatch. I can't seem to find thatch anywhere. So thatch you get from hitting a tree with a pickaxe, but you also get it from your fists if you hit trees. That's not a tree, that's a bush. Yeah, I was trying to do I was trying to grab stuff out of it. I can't seem to grab anything. Oh. You just um, passed out. You ran out of stamina. <laughs> <laughs> That's another thing that can happen. You got to watch your stamina level. If you if you get too tired out, you will pass out. You'll fall asleep. And then you're vulnerable and you can be killed, you need eaten. If you're just lying there. That's the no good. Yeah, you got to watch your stamina level really carefully. The screen will start to turn purple around the edges when you're running out of stamina, so you can keep an eye on it that way too. But the icon right. in the uh, on the side there, there's a lightning bolt. That's your yep. stamina. Um, and when it goes down, it starts to turn gray. When it's full, it's blue. So. Alrighty then. Alright, you just woke up. Alright, I'm gonna craft a torch. Um, apparently I can't. Oh, I don't know. No, I don't have flint. Oh. Right. Flint. I need to run down here and get some flint out of this boulder. Alright. Don't get eaten by a dinosaur. Now. So a pickaxe, so it matters what tool you use to harvest stuff. A pickaxe will get you more, right. more flint and less stone, and an axe will get you more stone and metal and less flint. Okay? Alright. I leveled again, so I'm going to go and ahead I, and put another okay. point into weight. And every time you level... Oh, I leveled yeah. twice. Every time you level, you get to pick an engram. <laughs> so I'm gonna, and you get. Uh, what does that do for you? You learn them, and those are the things that you can, you can, um, build. Oh wow! So it's kind of like uh, you get plans. Yeah, basically. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to learn clothes. Yeah. Okay. There now. I can craft an axe. Um, let's see. I want to craft spears, but I need more wood. I'm going to craft a fire. <coughs> Excuse me. Bless you. And I'm going to craft yeah, so, so. clothes. So you need to collect bushes and stuff. You need to harvest the bushes to collect um, okay. fiber so you can make clothes. Okay. Sounds good. And then all you do is double click on the clothes in your inventory after you um, craft them and you can, and that will automatically equip them. Got it. All right. I leveled again. I'm going wow. to put a point in weight again. So and which stones did you get the flints out of? The boulders. You have to actually hit them with a pickaxe to get flint. Alright. I'm going to learn the storage box, and I'll we'll start learning buildings as well. I need some more. I don't have any more points. Alright, so, so how many hits before my pickaxe dies? Um, I don't know if it, I don't know. It, it's, um, it'll lose, it'll lose condition with each hit you do. Okay. So I'm going to put a fire down so that we can. Uh, whoops, wrong button. Okay. 
I'm gonna have to get used to the, the buttons are different from Fallout, so I keep pushing the wrong buttons. <laughs> <laughs> Go figure. Okay. I also crafted an axe, so I can start cutting down trees. Putting some wood. Alright. And you said you want me at 200 weight before, before you start I take points. any other points. Yeah, because we're going to be collecting so much stuff that you need the, uh, you need it. The carry weight, or you're going to be over encumbered all, all the right. time. And we level so fast in the first few levels that it's fine. You're going to, you're going to, yeah. All right, I'm cooking meat so that we can eat because we're going to be hungry very soon. So how okay. you cook meat is you just stick some wood in the campfire's inventory and you put some meat in the campfire's inventory and then just let it cook. It'll cook. It'll take a few minutes to cook to cook it all. Oh, all right. That's funny. It's kind of <laughs> like uh, <laughs> it's kind of like the way they do it in Minecraft. I hate to mention that because you know that's a kids game, but. <laughs> oh, I think you just offended people. Well, I, know. I probably did. <laughs> yeah. I've never played Minecraft, so I don't know. Uh, my son and I used to play it quite a bit. Alright, campfire owner, Dova. Oops, I don't want to put out the fire. Uh, you, <laughs> I have to push um, A, uh, no X to open it. It won't let me open it. It says owned by Dova. Oh, uh, we're going to need to form a, a tribe so that you can use my stuff. What are we going to call our tribe? I don't know. What should we call our tribe? We could be the Hakawi from an old joke. What old joke? <laughs> it's from F Troop. <laughs> that was the name of the Indian tribe there, and it goes from a long winded story that uh, ends with a punchline of uh, somebody saying, Where the heck are we? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, so that's probably a bad idea. I'm killing another dodo. Alright. Because we're going to need to get, um, we're going to need to get hide, lots and lots of hides, so that we can build beds. Okay. So, when you die, mm -hmm. did, did you die? What are you sleeping here for? What did you do? Did um, this is the fourth time I've crashed out of the game tonight. Oh, you crashed? Oh. Yeah. I am coming back in now. But. Okay. All right. I got. I some don't know what's going on with it. Huh. I'm gonna put so, my meat anyway. in this there, and now I can eat. And to drink. You just walk into the water till you're in the water and you push a uh, triangle and you'll drink. Or you can just swim. Triangle? At, sorry, I'm used to PS4 controller still sometimes. <laughs> why? You push Y and you'll you'll drink when you walk into the water. I was gonna say. <laughs> now I'm trying to get enough um, com components to build a box so we can store our stuff. I need wood. Wood. All right. I'm cold. Now you can go stand by the fire to warm up. Okay. okay. All right. Got lots of wood. I'm over encumbered. Which is what you don't want to be in this game, for sure. Right, All right. Because then you can't run. Yeah. All right. I'm going to craft a box. I'm going to craft two boxes. Okay. Because we're going to collect stuff real quick, real fast between the two of us. Okay. And then we'll just set them over here by the fire, and we can start dumping stuff into it. So, let's see. Whoops. Wrong button again. Alright, you jumping around over there. 
Okay, there. Oh, these boxes. boxes. All, right. <clears throat> All right, but I don't think I can use them. I think I have to get my own. No. Oh, we're back to the tribe conversation. Yeah, we need to we need to form a tribe. Let's do that. How do we do that? Yeah. <laughs> um, if I go up to you, hold for options. Recruit. Oh, yes. Here we go. Recruit to new tribe. Okay. So how do I request that you to join the tribe? You look like an old man. Oh, hold Y. Uh, no, I, I just recruited you. Accept. Oh, it says recruit to tribe of Dova. Did you, did you accept it? I did. All right, now see if you can access the fire or the boxes. Uh, storage zero fifteen. Why access inventory? Yes. Oh, okay. cool. There, we're in a tribe. The tribe of Dova. <coughs> <laughs> That's right. <laughs> and you can take the food out of there and eat it too. So, all right. So dump anything. So dump hides, thatch, rocks, flint. Um, wood fiber into this box. All right. Okay. Don't put. Well, put <clears throat> put um, narco berries in there. Those are the black ones, and put um, the major berries in there. Those are the purple ones. And all the rest you don't have to worry about. But that is okay. what we want to put in the boxes, and you want to do it as often as you can. Can we drop and stuff? You just drop meat on the ground. What happened there? Mm -hmm. oh, I didn't mean to. Okay. <laughs> This is a silly game, but okay. I think I ended up taking like all the meat out, which would be bad. I did. That's not right. I'll put some back. You... No, there's a couple in there. Some of it's spoiled okay. already. Yeah, it spoils pretty quick. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> so, it spoils one at a time on a, on a stack. So like if there's a stack of 20, they'll spoil one at a time and not all at once. All right. How do you eat it? You're eating it. Am I? Yeah, I can see you eating it. So do you put it, put the food in your quick bar. Okay. And then you can eat it. She says it as if that made sense. So you just open your menu. <laughs> you you select an object, then you move your I see. You dig I down and you okay. pick which oh, slot nope, you want to put it in. All right, I leveled again, so I'm gonna. I leveled a couple times. All right, I'm gonna finish um, grabbing engrams for. Oh, there's the sleeping bag, and I'm gonna do the building pieces. All right, I can build a. I can build us a hut now. Should we try to build our wow. first hut just right here on the beach? Might as well. That sounds good to me. We'll be like Gilligan's Island here. Did you just crash again? Yep. Drop Ooh. right out. A trilobite. I'm gonna kill it. It's really hard to hit these guys. I need to craft some spears. It's hard to hit the max. Ah. Try to get him before he goes into the water. Come here. Get him. Nah, don't go in the water. This guy's level 50. Nah, where'd you go? Oh. <laughs> it is hard to hit these guys with an axe. Because it doesn't have Did a long enough reach. No, he's almost dead. Oh, and I'm gonna run out of stamina though. There, I got him. Okay, I gotta take a breath before I can. <laughs> okay. Alright, where'd you go? There you I are. I don't seem to be getting. Oh, there it goes. Okay. I'm getting chitin from him and pearls. 
plus me. Oh, I got a black pearl. Those are rare. All right. Awesome. Um, let's put rare stuff or stuff we're not going to use right away in the other box. Let's, I think we can do that. I got a black pearl and I got white pearl. I got ten silica pearls. So these are going to be... Nice. We're going to need this stuff later on. Um, later on in the game. We don't need them right now. But it's okay. important that we keep them because they're harder to get. They're, they're more rare materials. Um... So the um, cooking fire has only three slots in it. If they're okay. all three full, you got to empty one before you can put anything else in it. Just so you know. All right. All right, so um, let's craft some um, foundations. I need fiber, thatch, and wood. Alright, I'm getting patch and wood. Okay, we have some, but yes, we're going to always need more. <laughs> we are never ever going to stop collecting materials in this game. <laughs> so is there anything we can do to keep these berries from uh, spoiling on us so quickly? No, uh, berries spoil really fast. You just have to just keep cooking more. But you don't really okay. need the berries. You can eat them. Okay. All right, I need more thatch. All right, should I just drop it in this box here? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, I'll craft the door. Wow, you can set a pin code? Yeah, you can lock them. That's kind of cool. Ooh, I need to make some spears. You should. Is it a real stuff. pin, or is it just being silly? I think it's a real pin. I never locked mine. You should make so, um, some spears because that's going to be your best weapon in this early in the game. Okay, I'll make some. And you need to make several because they break. You only get a few hits out of each one. Okay. So you're going to want at least you know five to ten spears on you all the time. Okay. They're pretty cheap to make. What else did I need for that? There you go. Flint. Okay. Oh, you need some flint. I got some. Well, I'm gonna go get more, anyways. So I'm gonna need more. There you go. Thank you. Save metal too. Okay. If you get any metal okay. when you're collecting flint, yep. put it in the other box, the second box. Okay. Oh, I leveled again. You will level very quickly at the beginning. And, you know, gradually not level as fast. Oh look, a turtle! A big, big turtle. Don't hit it. Okay. Because they become aggressive if you attack them. And they're slow, but we just don't need that. <laughs> you know I what I I think I would you know, get aggressive if somebody was hitting me too. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna craft a bunch of spears. Let's do eight. Eight spears is good. Oh. And I should level up. Okay. I'm going to choose another engram. Let's see. I am going to choose Immortal and Mortal Mortar and Pestle. Okay. Oh, I should choose the bed, actually. Why is that? Um, so when you die, um, you you spawn back at bed. You you can you can use a bed to spawn back at. Otherwise, you spawn in a random location in your zone. Oh. In your zone, you can pick the zone you want to spawn in, but it's a random spot in your zone. So if you build a camp and then you travel far away from it, did you crash again? Yep. 
What is up with that? <laughs> it's, um, so we were testing earlier and it wasn't doing any of this. Um, my menu's um, acting wonky. I can barely move things around. I like have to spam buttons. That's weird. Um, we do have a really nasty storm over us right now, so I don't know if that's part of it or what. Oh, okay. Oh, by the way, don't drop yes. spoiled meat. Don't drop it on the ground. Keep it. Okay. Um, because you use it later. We will use it for um, making stuff to tame our dinosaurs. They like the smelly meat. Was that thunder I just heard? Yeah, it's a nasty storm. Oh, over dear. Us. Well, I hope I don't lose ya. That's not good. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I need to make more of these. I am loading in the island ruins. Okay. It's probably getting... Is it getting close to nighttime yet? It seemed like it was getting dark before I crashed out. No, it's not getting dark yet. Okay. Anyway, I'm going to start building our first little hut. I have one foundation <laughs> so far. <laughs> I need more thatch. It was thatch I needed. Okay. Can you grab it out of my sleeping character? Because right, he had, I think he had like 200. Um, if I can find him. Oh, there he is. Yes, I can. I will take it. There you go. I'll take your wood, too. Okay. Now I can make another one. More foundations. So maybe, since this is a house for both of us, let's make it a 4x4. Four four. Not a 4x4, four four, sorry. 2x2. <laughs> Four, four sounds pretty big. Four foundations is what I meant to say. I need more. Ah, okay. Fibers. <clears throat> wow, I can hear the thunder so well. <laughs> I know, it's crazy. It's crazy. Okay. Last time we had thunderstorms in January like this, I think we ended up with, and you have to keep in mind, I'm quite a bit south of you. Mm -hmm. uh, I think we ended up with something like uh, 19 inches of snow, which we don't know what to do with. 19 inches? That's pretty good. I mean, I, we don't even usually get that much snow. Yeah, it was, it was nuts. I built foundations! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> now I guess we need some walls. Yes. Or beds. Do we need walls or beds first? Well, I have to learn the bed engram first, but that'll definitely be next. It's funny, the uh, Minecraft uses beds for the spawn point. So there's, there's all kinds of stuff that's been, you know, copied between these different games. Mm-hmm. Well, all... All of the, um, all of the survival games kind of use the same model. Oh, uh, okay. And nobody gets sued? I mean, come on, I thought, you know, I thought you had to be creative. <laughs> I thought these big, rich software companies could afford IP lawyers. <laughs> I don't know. It's just a four. All right. Nope. Oops, I keep eating instead of building. <laughs> That's not going to get me anywhere. Snacking's good, right? Mm. All right, I'll put the door on this side. I'm just building a basic square hut, and we can build a more elaborate base later. Right. Are you back yet? So can these... Um, I am loading in now. Okay. So can the little dinos crash through the huts, or do they leave them alone? <laughs> they can. Um, they can eat. Yeah. Dinosaurs can destroy thatch pretty good. Okay. So what's it going to take to be safe from the little dinos? 
Oh, we need to get stronger building materials like wood or Good. stone. Okay. But we have to have the engrams to use them. Right, and you have to reach the correct level to unlock the engrams. Right, okay. How many walls did I still need? Two? Okay. Don't forget a doorway. Can we have a window too? Windows are good. No, window walls are a different engram. Of course it is. We'll learn all of them. We'll get there. Don't worry. So do we have to get the, like, I don't know, the Morgantown train station to get that one? Or where to get that one? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I leveled again. So... I can get the bed now! Yay! And I'm going to learn... Well, I can't learn that yet because I don't have enough ingram points. So you get, what, three engram points per level? Is that how it works? Uh, no, you or get does it more change than that. You I level think up? it's different. I don't know. Okay. I don't think I ever noticed. I'll have to notice that next time. So currently yeah, the five. first time I leveled, I think I was doing two or three levels because so, I had like nine of them sitting there. Hmm. Okay. Let's see here. I need to grab... a long load screen. Hopefully it'll let me in here soon. Yeah, I'm going to level a lot faster than you at this rate. That's fine. You're supposed to be good at this game, remember? Oh my goodness, there's a hut on my beach. There's a hut on your beach. Hello. Hi. Oh. Hi. I'm going to put the door on it now. Hi, let me out. <laughs> <laughs> Do we need stairs, or should we just jump? You don't have to jump. It's like in Fallout 76. You can just boop up into it. Boop? Is that a word? Boop. If it's not too high, you can you can just it'll just pop you up on top. Oop. Hey, uh, we're running out of trees on this part of the beach. Yes, we're gonna have to travel far and wide. Shouldn't we be more sustainable? We know what happens when you're not sustainable. <laughs> They'll be, they will respawn. And if you want to preserve the beauty, you can be selective and only cut down every like other every other tree or <laughs> whatever. If you want. It's a little bit late for that now. Mm -hmm. We can at least see our enemies coming out. True. <clears throat> All right. So at some point... Huh? Oh, I'm going to knock myself out again. I was going to say, so at some point... Um, what do we do from here? At some point, what do we do from here? <laughs> do we just run around this beach and keep building up this hut? Like, doing like Gilligan Island stuff, or what? Yeah. Well, we're going to start exploring. Okay. And, uh, let's see. What do I need to craft a bed? I'm over encumbered. I need hides to craft a bed. We need 40 hides. 40? Mm -hmm. All right. So what to are we going to kill? Bed. Now, the sleeping bag uses less hides, but you can only use it one time. And then, and then it's not uh, usable again. I'm over encumbered. Oh, I'm over encumbered. Well, at least you can still walk when you're over encumbered. So back when I used to play Ark a couple years ago, if you got over encumbered, you couldn't move at all. You were just stuck. That was it, huh? Yeah, you were just stuck. So at least I can still walk, <laughs> if kind of slowly. Well, so far I haven't seen any enemies. We're gonna have All to. All right, so is that a good thing? I guess. It will. Well, yeah, it makes this beach fairly safe. We usually there's some Dilophosaurus over there, but I didn't see them. There's some dodos there this time instead. Oh, you want metal in the second one? Okay, I'll do that. Well, you know, just to be sort of organized with it. <laughs> 
Oh, our fire went out. Okay, what do we do to fix that? Put more wood on it. Oh, okay. <laughs> you know, <coughs> like you do. <laughs> Alright. Um. So. Yes. What was I going to say? I don't remember. I don't know. Oh, well, if there's no, um, if there's no meat cooking, we don't need to, like, waste wood putting it in the fire. So I'll just take the meat out. Okay. Oh, and also this charcoal, we can keep that because it will be used in the future, um, with some alchemy and you can use okay. other different things, paint and stuff, but it's for the future. So you don't have to do it right now. So you're level six. I'm level n nine. <laughs> Alrighty then. I got three levels on you while you were gone. While I was dorking around with my crashing Xbox. Did you craft spears? Not yet. That's right. So I need to get some wood out. Alright, mm -hmm. so what do you need for spears? Well, you just go into your crafting menu. Yeah, I need to take some of my... Well, I'm asking. And if you just hold the... If you just select the, the spear, it'll show you what you need and the crafting requirements. A little thing will pop up. All right. You need 12 fiber, 2 flint, and 8 wood to craft one spear. So you're going to want to craft between 5 and 10 spears because they do break after just a few hits. Okay. And spears are the best weapon instead of like axes or anything else. So yeah, spear is the best weapon early on because oh, I leveled again just standing here. <laughs> because the reason that spears are the best weapon for now is because <clears throat> um okay, I'm going to craft narcotic. And I'm going to craft a bola, or I'm going not going to craft it. I'm going to learn it. The bola, and I don't have enough to craft the bow, but I'm, I'll I'll learn the arrows. Okay, next time I level, I'll I'll learn the bow. All right. The spear okay. is the best weapon early on because it keeps your enemy at a distance from you. Because it's a long range, it's a longer okay. range weapon than your axe or your or your uh, your pickaxe. So you'll um, you can reach stuff better. Okay. So like I was having trouble killing that um, that trilobite earlier is because I couldn't reach right. it with my axe. It was down too low on the ground. So with a spear, you can you can hit <gasps> further away from you. And so if you're up against something like a Dilophosaurus, which is probably the first enemy we're going to come across, um, okay. you can keep, you have a better chance of keeping them away from you where they can't reach you. That's why it's better. Now, um, be careful swimming, by the way. I would not recommend yep. getting in the water because there are piranhas in some of these ri in some of these rivers and stuff. Oh, all right, that <laughs> sounds like fun. And they will kill you really? so fast. Yeah. Hmm. And there's also sharks. Oh gosh. But you can go and take a look under the water. Those fish right there aren't. Those are fish aren't. Uh, so it looks like there's nothing currently in this water that's going to eat us. But fish okay. fish are also a good source of food. If you okay. see a fish ever, um, kill it and get its meat. All right. Actually, we're going to need to go hunt. We're going to need to go meat hunting here pretty soon because we're running low. Okay. Well, not really. I have 11. Yeah, we need some leather, right? We do. We need hides to build the bed. Actually, how many hides do we have? We have... Where'd they go? 
They're right here because I hit the wrong button and put them back. Oh. <laughs> we have 32. 32. Okay, so we need more, obviously. Let's go hunt some dodos, yeah? You ready? Yep, did, did let's you... do it. All right. I saw some over no, here. I... Hmm? All right. I'm still working on my spears, making spears. Okay. <laughs> I am really, really slow at this. That's all right. You'll get the hang of it. I'm <clears throat> only fast at it because I played it before. <laughs> it's a lot to take in all at once. It, there's a there's a steep learning curve in this game. They don't, and there's no tutorials. There's no instructions on how to do anything. So you just sort of are thrown into it, and you just got to figure it all out. Right. <coughs> okay. I think that'll be five spears when I'm all done here. All right. Oh, there's a dodo right there. I'll just go down and get it. All right. Hello, dodo. Oh, there's another, um... Okay, don't harvest the meat or hide. So, you have to decide, when you kill an animal, you have to decide what you want from it most. Meat or hide. Okay. Um, to get the meat, you use a pickaxe, and to get the hide, you use the axe. Oh, all right. Or, yeah, okay. So I also got thatch and wood from it. Oh, no, that was my ac my uh, axe breaking. My axe already broke. <laughs> oh, no. I need to craft another one. Let's see. Let's see if I have enough on me to craft another one now. I don't. Ooh, here's another uh, trilobite. But first, I need to go get some wood. I got some meat. I'll put it in the fire. Because we okay. are going to be needing to eat constantly. So, Once we get to higher levels, it's not going to be so hard to stay supplied. We won't be needing to grind as much. And once we tame dinosaurs um, yes. to do the, the, the harvesting for us, it'll be a lot easier. So these birds look like they're pulling fish out of the water, but I don't see any fish. Yeah, oops, I accidentally crafted a new one. Instead of repairing my old one. Oh well, I'll stick Oh, on. that's cool. So you can repair the old one? You can repair them, yes. I'll stick the other one in the box. In case one of us breaks one, we can just... Um, okay. We can just use it. <clears throat> Or in case we die and uh, rent, <laughs> lose our stuff. So when you die, you lose all your stuff. Well, you don't lose it for good. I, it just where'd you go? I was going down, way down the beach. Um, on what side? I'm actually, kind of. Oh, you're on. From okay. if you're looking down the beach, there you go. Yep. Yeah. I see. You're on the the west side of the beach. So I was going down the east side because I saw some dodos down here. All right, I'm with you. <clears throat> Um, yeah, so if you die, you drop a bag with all your stuff in it, similar to Fallout 76, only you drop everything, not just, you know, your junk stuff. You drop your, your clothing, everything. So, oh, we've got oh. compies. They are aggressive, so use your spears to kill them. They will gang up on you. These are level one. These are pretty low level. These are what killed that guy in Jurassic Park 2, remember? Oh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, so All use right. your axe to get the hides. Okay. I have to build an axe. Oh, you don't have one? Oh, come on, why is it? There it goes. There we go. Come on. some reason it doesn't want to harvest. Oh yeah. Well. We got 14 hide off of it. Cool. 
All right. Watch your weight, though. We don't want to get over encumbered. But let's run back and dump our hides and stuff. Okay. And you'll want to cook the meat um, as soon as oh, you I get it. Oh, I need to get some water. Yeah. Well, that's easy to do. <laughs> yep. Okay. Now it says I'm hot. I should find a place to rest. Yeah, because you've been running around. All right, we have enough. Um, we have enough stuff to make a bed now. I'm going to make one. Okay. Um, whoops. What did I just do? <laughs> this menu Where do you, Which box do you want the uh, leather in? Um, whatever one. There's leather in already. <laughs> I don't remember. All right. Um, okay, I'm going to make a bed. Um, oh, first I have to learn the ingrown. No, I didn't. I already did that. Oh, wait. What else do I need for a bed? I need fiber. Okay. I can get that out. No, I can't. There's no fiber in there. I don't have any fiber. All right. I'll go I ahead. have some, I think. Yeah, I have some. Okay, well, we need to collect more anyway. We're going to be using a lot of it. Okay. There's 66 in the box on the uh, right. Okay. And I have 15 raw meat. That's amazing. <laughs> so put some of it in the fire and then um, put That's some of I'll it do. in the box. So we do want um, we do want to spoil some of our meat because that's how you make uh, narcotics with it to um, and you need narcotics to tame dinosaurs. Uh, that sounds to me like that will happen later. No, we can tame oh. we can tame something pretty pretty quick off. We just have to find the right thing. Okay, I leveled from building a bed. And what else can I get? Let's see. I was going to get the bow next. That's right. Ooh, you can get a bow already? What do I need? What is the prerequisite for a bow? Is it the... The club. Okay. Well, I want to. I, I do. Okay. Want, I don't want to get it. What is the prerequisite for a bow? Oh, it's a sling, slingshot. Okay. Right. All right. I can build bows now. So bows we will need for when we want to tame uh, dinosaurs. We need to make trank arrows to knock them out. So. Okay. Yeah. That sounds like a good idea. I'm going to eat, too. And drink. All this running around making me thirsty. So can you get sick from eating too many berries? I don't think so. Although there are diseases in the game. I, I never actually got one when I played back in the day. So I don't know how... <laughs> how um often you can get one. Um, okay, so I'm going to put a bed in here, and we can okay. use this to respawn if we die. <gasps> Oops, wrong button. There. there we go. Now you can only, um, so beds have a timer on them, I think, and I don't know how long it is. You can respawn at it, and then you there's a timer for next time you can respawn. So it's always a good idea to have more than one bed, if you're, especially if you're planning on going into some dangerous areas, and you think you might die a lot. Okay, and then are the beds owned? Uh, no, because now that we're on a tribe, we can use each other's stuff. Okay. All right, so let's... Uh, let's see. My goodness, you can craft stuff a lot higher than I can, because I can't even unlock a bow yet. Well, I'm... yeah. I'm oh. higher level than you, remember? I remember. <laughs> All right, so we need to, let's see, I think I'm going to, I think I'm going to split, so if you split the stacks of me, since, since items spoil, um, yes. 
since items spoil one at a time, it'll just take the one off the top of the stack. And then it'll take a long time for them to spoil, for the whole stack to spoil. So if you split the stack so that there's only one per stack, they'll spoil all yeah. at once really fast. Really? Because they okay, do so it all at, one... all at once instead of one at a time. I can't get in the house. There we go. Uh, so I'm going to spoil. I'm going to spoil okay. some of the meat that we picked up, and I'm going to cook some of it. Okay. Because we need to start collecting rotten meat so that we can make um, trank arrows and stuff, so we can make our narcotics. Okay. Because then um, it takes a while to to save up that stuff. And then we need to, so we need to save it up for a while, and then by the time we finally find a dinosaur we want to tame, we'll have what we need. Instead of okay. being like, ooh, let's tame this one. Oh, wait, we can't. We don't have the stuff yet. <laughs> you know? Got it. All right. Um, do you want to run down the beach and see what there is to see? Sounds good to me. Okay, let's do it. See if there's any enemies down here. <laughs> it's gonna I didn't be see a... anything when I was down here before. Yeah. And we should be always <clears throat> collecting materials as well up until right before we <clears throat> right before we get over. <laughs> I'm dehydrated. You're dehydrated. Dehydrated. I'm going to get some more flint. What does earned, shared, tribe of Dova mean? Well, so when you're in a tribe, everything you do gives me a little bit of experience, and everything I do gives you a little bit of experience. So you just earned some experience from me, because I destroyed a rock. Sweet! <laughs> Yeah. Oh, lucky! What'd you find? I found a, a Lystro, and they, um, you can tame them. If you put berries in your, um, the last tab of your quick menu, you can okay. hand tame them by feeding them berries. And then they can become your pet. And they will follow you around. There, I'm taming him. So does it do anything for us? Now you have to wait till he gets hungry again before you give him anything else. No, he doesn't really do anything for you. He's just mostly looks like a pet. Um, okay. <laughs> and they're really slow. Well, I'll let that be your project. So you don't really want them. I mean, he'll poop for you and you can collect his poop. Uh, joy, I guess. Well, you need poop to make fertilizer to grow crops, so... There's that. There's that. Mm -hmm. We got Where'd a stegosaurus go? down there. I'm just not oh, going too far away from this Lystro because I want to tame it. Have a little pet. I had a... <sighs> there, what should I name him? You tamed it. What should I name it? Uh, Lizzie. I don't know if it's a male or a female. It didn't say. But it just starts with L-Y-S. So. Oh. Lizzie. I'm going to name it Joey. Well, Joey. <laughs> but it's probably a girl. It doesn't actually say if it's a girl or not. No, it's a well, male. Okay, you're just gonna it have does. To check up on that. There, it's a male. So you can oh, pet okay. it, and it'll do a little oh, dance for yeah. you. It'll it'll flip. Um, so then you also want to put um, berries in its inventory. Uh, actually, he likes the purple berries better. But I'll. Uh, whoops. I'll put. No, stop! 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 stop. I'll put these berries in as an inventory. Oh, you were hungry. Okay. Here you go. He's eating them. 
faster than I can put them in. <laughs> I'm still one at a That's time. Alright, here. Have the um, yellow ones and the blue ones too, just so I don't have to constantly feed you all the time. Here you go. Have all of these berries, Joey. There you go. Cute little guy. Okay. Now he'll follow me now. Looks like he leveled up. Um, no, I don't think he's leveled up yet. Um, no, it turns... He's got a green arrow over his head. Yeah, it turns yellow when they're, um, when they're level. Are you over oh. encumbered? I'm over encumbered. Uh-oh. It's a long way back to camp. You're not supposed to get over encumbered. <laughs> Should I drop some of it? It's just wood. Ooh. Should I drop some of it? Well, I might be able to pick it up. So yeah, go ahead and drop some. I see a meat-eating dinosaur over there. At the end of the lagoon, you see it? Yep. That will kill us. Big time. So let's not go over <laughs> there. It's, um, okay. I forgot what they're called. They eat fish. There's a dodo coming up. Do we want that guy? That's not a dodo. What is that? That's one of those pelican things, and they will attack you. And they will oh, kill okay. you, too, if you, uh, don't fight back. <laughs> come on, Joey. All right, come on, Joey. Let's take him home. We can leave him at the house. <coughs> Alrighty. Here's that wood if you can carry it. I don't know if you can or not. Okay. Yeah, I can. No problem. Come on, Joey. You can make it. Let's go. He's so slow. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, you know what? We have been going on for over an hour with this episode. I think we might need to call wow. it, call it uh, call it good for the day, and then uh, next week we can uh, come back with a new episode. So, you guys, tell us in the comments what you think so far. Do you like? Do you like it? Um, you want to see more? Um, we're gonna do more, whether you want to see them or not. So <laughs> there you go. But. <laughs> 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 At least until you come up with another idea, right? <laughs> anyway, I had I'm having fun. Are you Dink? Do you like it? Yeah, I'm uh you know what? Ever since my uh Xbox got uh stable, yeah. <laughs> yeah, right, exactly. Come on, oh. Joey! Oh, it's a trilobite, get it. Get it? Yeah, mm. get it. Use your spear. Don't let it go in the water though. I know. Alright. I think I've hit it a single time yet. You have. Oh, okay. Where'd he go? There. He, <gasps> there. he did. Yay. Oops. <laughs> I think you got it all. I didn't get any materials. That oh, you're kidding me. Oh, well, I'll put it in the box. I didn't, Over I didn't get it again. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess we'll start out uh, at the hut when we load in next time, right? Yes, we will. There you go, Joey. Come oh. on. Come over here by the hut so that you can stay safe. Oh, he's trying to squeeze between you and the box. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Sounds like my dog. He's gonna go where he's gonna go. Come a little closer to the hut. All right, that's good. Okay, so now I can um, go to options. No, back. Um, whoops, no, I don't want to access one. It's all right. I want to behavior. There you go. Um. um disable following. There. Now he's going to stay put right there where we left him. Nice. Then we don't have to worry about him getting killed by something. Alright. Sounds good. I have nerdy glasses. What's up with that? And that's a skin for your hat, I think. Or maybe it's just glasses that you can put on. I don't know. Um, you need to put the rare items, well, I guess, um, 
like the um, I can't keep up with which one goes where so I figured you would scold me how do I repair something you just yeah. click on it in your um, you just like go to use it in your inventory if you have in your quick menu if you have the um, the items in your inventory to repair it it'll just repair it automatically All right, so I need a stone and some thatch <clears throat> yes. And here I went and said that we were going to stop, and then we're not. <laughs> yeah, uh, we need to stop then. I didn't know how much grinding you want on the camera and how much you don't. Well, that's a question, too, to ask the viewers. You guys... Do you want us to skip all of this crafting and stuff that we're doing? I mean, basically, this is what the game is. You, you do a ton of crafting and gathering, and uh, that's what it is. It's a, it's a pretty grindy game, um, but you... I don't know, it might be hard to skip it, because it's, a, it's practically all we're going to be doing for a while, and stuff can happen while we're doing that, and I don't know. I don't know, you guys. Right. Leave your feedback in the comments because I would really like to know what you guys think so far. And uh, anyways, that's it. All right. Until next week. So we'll see you guys later. And uh, remember to play safe, play nice, and have fun. So, that's bye. right. Bye, guys.